There are few actors these days who have a career quite like Australian A-lister Hugh Jackman. Not only is he an action hero who can outmuscle almost anyone, but he can also sing and dance and has dramatic chops on top of it all. In addition to his one-of-a-kind resume, Jackman also has a rather unique marriage to fellow Australian actor Deborah Lee Furness. While there's very little that's out of the ordinary about the long-lasting lovers themselves, the way Hollywood treats them is a little strange. And here's why. Furness was first. Jackman and Furness met in 1995 on the set of the Australian TV show Corelli. Getting hired for the show was Jackman's first big break out of drama school, but Furness had already done almost 20 films at that point. Furness played the title role of a prison psychologist, while Jackman portrayed a tattooed convict who suffered brain damage while in police custody. The show only lasted one season, but it would change their lives forever. It gets better and better, I can honestly say that. And I'm kind of really grateful that I met before anything kind of happened, because everything that's happened in my career and on screen, off screen, we've always done it together. And Despite Jackman's truly tragic haircut back in the early days, he had chemistry with Furness right from the beginning. In fact, Jackman has revealed that she was such a big star to him in those days that he was nervous about approaching her. And I said, oh, look, I've got a crush on you, I'll get over it. And she went, oh, really? And I was like, oh, this is bad. <laughs> and she goes, yeah, i got one on you too. And I'm like, oh, right. The two were married the following year, and the rest is Hollywood history. The Rumor Mill It's not unusual for men to date younger women in Hollywood, but when the reverse is true, eyebrows seem to raise. Such is the case for Hugh and Deborah, who got together when he was 26 and she was 39. But the two have also had to deal with what they call chopped liver syndrome, with his career emerging as the more successful of the two over time. It can be, oh, there's Hugh Jackman and get yeah, that yeah. person. I've literally seen her knocked away. Worse still, Jackman has never been able to shake the rumors that he prefers the company of other men to his own wife. I mean, you can't be a star without having a gay rumor out there, can you? Furness herself has said that she finds the rumors offensive. It's a lie. It's just the bottom line, so it's just offensive. If he was gay, fine, he would say he's gay. It has gotten so out of whack. However, there are those who think the couple might protest a little too much, especially when it comes to them sharing TMI details about their bedroom life to prove their undying affection. Silly. Yeah, silly. Stalker status. A lot of celebrities have had to deal with deranged fans, but few stars have run into experiences quite as scary as Jackman and Furnace. From 2012 to 2013, Jackman was repeatedly stalked by an obsessed fan named Catherine Thurston. In one particularly disturbing encounter, Thurston allegedly approached Jackman with a razor and told Furness she was going to marry her husband. The stalker was later sentenced to six months time served and five years probation in order to stay away from the Jackmans. Setting Boundaries in 2015, Furness revealed that she's got one major rule about who her husband can and cannot lock lips with on his screen projects. I've told his agent he's not allowed to work with Angela. I'm sure Fair she's very to. nice, and I love all what she's doing for shining a light on the awareness for adoption. Though Furness quickly admitted she was just kidding about her Jolie ban, Jackman came forward with his own addendum to that rule. Yeah, I've been married for 20 years. We have a lot of rules. We're very balanced. So she said that, and as long as she doesn't work with Brad Pitt, we're cool. So either they're very guarded about each other keeping company with the former A-list couple, or they've got a shared sense of humor about the whole Hollywood scandal cycle. Hey, maybe that's how they make it work, where so many other Tinseltown couples call it quits. Thanks for watching. Click the Nikki Swift icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.